today, you're rotten lot. Thank you for tuning in to the video today. We do have a bit of an oddball pedal on the board. It is the uh, TE2 Terra Echo from Boss. Now, essentially, it's a pitch shifting filtered delay, um, but it really is one of those effects that you would you can't just throw it on and use it as a normal delay. You don't have much control over the pitch shifting or the you don't have control over anything really. It's just got normal delay. Uh, knobs on it, but the effect that it uh, produces is very, very interesting. There's a fair bit of stuff it can do. I've even sort of got it back to sounding like reverb at one point, but uh, anyway, here we go. So you can hear it's got a filter sweep on it. It's got a little bit of pitch shifting in it in an arpeggiated way. And then it's also got your initial attack, delayed and repeated, which slows down over time. Check it out. So that is pretty much it. You have a tone knob, which changes the tone of the uh, repeats. So you can make it a lot more subtle. It's up full again for you. Back at 12 o'clock. Turn all the way down. I'm going to sit that back up at 12 o'clock. Just for the purposes of this video, and I've also just got the effect level at 12 o'clock. You can take it down to nothing, or you can bring it up louder than your initial signal. But as far as I know, there's no way to just get the wet signal. It really is a bit of an oddball effect. Now, you can go from a little bit of feedback. Just one sweep through the uh, envelope. To lots and lots and lots. And when it self oscillates, as I just uh, showed you, it does get pretty nasty and chaotic. See how long this goes for. Ages and ages, and that was with the tone all the way down. Okay. Now, in terms of speed, it goes from this slow. To this fast, which is really into reverb territory. So now I can use it like a reverb. So 
So yeah, makes a pretty nice reverb for a delay pedal. It's almost got that springy sort of boing sound to it. Trying to set it up right on the edge of self oscillation here. Trying to bring as much reverb out of it as I can. And that, my friends, is pretty much all it does. It's a very curious effect. So I have got it set up uh, with a OD3 in here as well, just to show you what it sounds like with a bit of dirt in the front of it. back into a reverb for Well, there you go. This is the Boss TE2 Terra Echo. I hope that was useful to you. you this is uh, also comes in the ME90 and maybe the ME80 as well. I think it comes in one of the 200 series or the 500 series delay pedals as well. Is it an oddball? Yes, it is. Could you take it to a gig and use it for anything unless you're a synthesizer player? Maybe not. Um, but yeah, anyway, look, it's a different effect. It's right out there if this is your thing. Um, please, please, in the comments, let me know how you use it. And uh, I'd love to hear what everybody else is doing with it. And if you've kept it, if you've sold it, if you've moved it on. I would like to thank uh, Joel very much for uh, letting me steal this from the local music shop at AMP Music. Uh, I will be returning it uh, because this is not mine. This is Joel's and it's for sale down at AMP Music if you're here in Australia and you want one. So. Thumbs up, like, subscribe, all that sort of stuff. It really helps us. We're almost up to 25,000 subs now. So thank you all so much for your support. It actually means a lot to us. So uh, thank you very much for uh, any clicking and interacting that you do with uh, this video. So uh, we'll see you in the next time. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.